welcome back to my channel. I know it's been quite some time since I've done a video for you guys, but today I'm here to do the I Heart Spring tag. And this tag will be in collaboration with some of the women from The Real Woman of YouTube. Definitely check those ladies out. Their links will be in the description bar. Let them know that Fearless Fat Girl sent you guys. And if you want to see what this video consists of and what my answers to the questions are, stay tuned. I have two favorite nail polishes that I want to share with you guys today. The first is going to be this Essie. It's called Boxer Shorts. It's this beautiful purple color. I'm so obsessed with it. It's like not super light, but it is just gorgeous. So this is definitely going to be my Easter nail polish color. And then the second color that I wanted to share with you guys is going to be this 320 Earl Grey. And it looks like this. Hopefully you guys could see what it looks like. Let me turn my lights a little bit. I feel like it's still kind of dark in here. But that is that one. And I'm absolutely in love with this shade. It is just so nude and neutral that it'll just go with everything. So two of my favorites. And here's a little hint for you guys um, that are nail polish addicts like myself that I'm becoming one. Um, definitely check out your local Big Lots, TJ Maxx, and Marshalls. They tend to have SC nail polishes and OPI nail polishes for under $4.99, which is an amazing deal because if you've ever shopped for nail polishes, you know that these bad boys can range up to, I've seen them for $11.99 here in California. So check out your local Marshalls, TJ Maxx, or Big Lots for your nail polishes. My favorite lip for the spring has always been this Lady Danger lipstick from MAC. You guys, I am so in love with this shade. It is so beautiful, like, let me see if you guys can see what it looks like. It just looks like this. It's like an orange red, and it's just perfect. It kind of gives you that bright lip, and I'm just so obsessed with it. I love it. I don't really wear too many dresses to be honest with you guys. I do tend to wear more of like a maxi skirt or skirts. I just kind of go for that a little bit more. But I do have one dress that I love to wear like for Easter or like spring parties and that is this beautiful, let me see if you guys can get the detailing. It's like a lace top and it has like the chiffon bottom. It is a high-low skirt. I have a fan going on above my head, so I don't want to like <laughs> hit myself. But it is a high-low skirt, and it is super gorgeous. And it is just like a little tube top. It's gorgeous. It's cute. And I can wear this with like cowboy boots, sandals, flats, heels, anything really. My go-to spring dress. I'm not a huge fan of flowers. I like fake flowers, but I just kind of go for the colors really. I don't care for the particular type of flower, sorry. Two of my favorite accessories for the spring are definitely cardigans. I don't know if you would count that as an accessory, but like kimonos and cardigans, I love those. But I know these are accessories, and that is glasses. I love sunglasses. I love that I'm able to start wearing them in the spring. So these are just two of my favorite. This one has like a cat eye, and I believe this one was like a dollar um, off of one of those sites. I'll try to link it down below if I can. But these glasses, and then I love these. They have like the gold trimming. On the side it's kind of like quilted right here these are just super huge super like cute <laughs> and I love them I am NOT a fan of expensive sunglasses because your girl goes through sunglasses like crazy I am NOT good with my sunglasses I break them I toss them I scratch them and I'm not about that life where I'm gonna spend my coins on expensive glasses so that I can just break them <laughs> but sunglasses are definitely some of my favorites Another favorite accessory for me this season is the scarf, you guys. It is so light, which I love, and it is just kind of like this peach color, like light peach color, and it has the gray on it. It also has like fringe at the end. It's just super cute. Let's see if I don't. Ugh. 
super comfy and I can just like, I don't know. Yeah, I'm just in love with this scarf, you guys. I think it's just perfect. So one trend that I'm really looking forward to this spring is the bright lips. I am all about lippies, lipsticks, lip glosses, and liquid lipsticks. Anything that goes on your lips, I'm good. <laughs> I can't wait to see what colors the drugstores come out with. So I'm super excited for that. One of my favorite candles, and I'll try to leave a picture of it somewhere in here, but one of my favorite candles is the Caribbean Escape from Bath & Body Works, you guys. I am so in love with that candle. I can't wait for every spring to come around so that I can go and stock up on that candle because that candle smells amazing. It makes my house smell so good, and I am so in love with that candle. My favorite perfume pretty much year round, but especially for the spring, is this I Am Happy by Maurice's. You guys, this perfume is super affordable. It's like $18, I believe, and it smells amazing. It's just like really spring-like, florally. I just love it, I don't know. I'm obsessed with this, and it was really, really affordable. And it's almost time for me to refill, as you guys can see. One of my favorites. Spring here in Fresno. Hmm. So far this year, usually the years before, like the last two, three years, it has been really, really hot spring. Like we really had no winter just because we were in a drought and rain just was not coming anywhere near here. <laughs> but um, right now, the spring is tending to be a little bit cloudy, um, a lot more fresh and like cool, which I really enjoy. I've lived in Oakland and the weather there is amazing. So to have a little bit of that feel here is just amazing. I love it. My favorite thing about spring is definitely the spring forward, the time change. I love the fact that it's starting to get darker later. That is just like the best thing ever. I just feel like I get more done throughout the day when it's not getting dark so fast. <laughs> I feel like this year I did become a spring cleaner. I am all about decluttering right now. I did read an amazing book, which I'll link down below, that has just completely, whoa, completely changed the way I think about my clutter. And I am so excited to like be cleaning and tossing old stuff and just really getting down to having only the things that I absolutely love and need in my life. That is so amazing. So definitely, yes, I am spring cleaner this year. We don't have too many plans. We were planning on going to Texas next month, but because of some things that are going on in my personal life, I just don't think we're gonna be able to do that just yet. I do plan on going to like the beach or something um, just to get out of Fresno, but nothing too concrete just yet. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this little tag and you guys got to know me a little bit better. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. Don't forget to check out those lovely ladies that I mentioned earlier in the description bar, all from The Real Woman of YouTube. If you don't know what The Real Woman of YouTube, it is a Facebook page created by Marcea from The Belts Plus One. Check her out. And pretty much what that is, is a place where all female YouTubers can go and kind of just learn from each other and share each other like share tips and tricks from what we've learned as being a youtuber and i absolutely love it you know we get to build relationships with other youtubers which is amazing so definitely check that out i will leave that in the description bar as well and again if you have been wondering where i've been or what's going on or why i've disappeared the last week and a half please check out my vlogging channel, which is also linked down below. And I pretty much post on there. Y'all, I'm gonna keep knocking these lights down. I pretty much post on there Monday through Friday. So today there will be another vlog going up in just a little bit. And yeah, I hope you guys are having a blessed day. 
and welcome to all my new subscribers and to all my old subscribers or my regular subscribers that have been here for a while now. Thank you for being here and continuing to support me. I love y'all and I will talk to y'all in the next video. Bye!